This is Cassell from Creation Cassell. In this video, we'll look at how to create a neon element using a script in PaintShop Pro. The script in question is called Neon Outline, and it will do exactly what it says, which is create an outline in a neon format. So you can start with a shape, whether it's a drawn shape or a preset shape. I'm going to draw a star. The actual color of the star or the element really doesn't matter because you will pick the color later on in the process. So now that I have my star, I'll just run the script. The script asks me whether I'm creating a neon effect based on a line drawing or a solid or a thick shape. So in this case, it's a solid shape. and I can choose to have a thin or a thick outline. The thin outline will be about 20 pixels and the thick outline will be about 50. So it will depend probably on the size of your element. I'm going to pick a thick outline. Now I can choose the color of my choice. So for a star, let's create it in yellow. It's preferred to use a darker color even though it's a yellow like which should be a lighter color because you will have a version that is lit so it will be increased in brightness. So I can get a dark yellow and I will still get something bright. And now you're done. Now the script has created one version of the neon that is off, so without any glow, and one version with the glow, which is yours to pick. You can also combine both if you prefer to have a more obvious color and still have the glow. Or you can change the blend mode to get a different effect. In addition, the original element was left in the layer palette. Although this was a vector and it was converted to a raster for the script, I can still use it. So if I want to keep the inside visible, that's my choice. Or I can just keep the outline. So this is how you create an outline using the Neon Outline script. Now what if I want to create a line drawing. So let's just turn off all those layers and I'll add a new raster layer. And using now my brush tool, I'll use white for visibility and I'll create a line drawing that is 45 pixels in size. That's because I will look to create the thick outline which is 50 pixels so I have to go a little under if I go higher than the 50 pixels then the script will automatically try to make an outline around it instead of using the lines themselves so I can write or draw a line and run the script Again, I'll use the line drawing this time and I'll make it thick.
this time I'll use a blue and again I'll use a darker version so I can get a lit version that is still visible and not too white And there we have it. We have this off version without the glow and we have the lit version with the glow and I can off also combine both if I want. In order to get the best results you have to be aware of a few details. So I'll, I guess I'll use this layer First, you need to remember that normally a neon will not have intersecting designs. So if your design needs an intersection of some kind, you're better off to use the eraser tool and make an obvious separation. Between the elements. before running the script. So here I'll try with the line drawing, thick drawing. And I'll choose my color. Again I choose a darker version. And there you have it. You have tubes, like neon tubes, that are not making any kind of intersection because they are tubes and they don't take on all the shapes that you want. They can just shape but stay as tubes, so as a very thin line. So that's how you can create neon outlines for your various projects. And you can do it on your own with this script in PaintShop Pro. Enjoy!